I'm Tasmanian Viking, and in this video we're going to go through the motor in Bromon, which is a Caterpillar 3304 PC. Short video just to uh, show you where we're at. Uh, enjoy, give us uh, a like, subscribe to the channel, and stay up to date on this and other further videos. Cheers. Okay, going up inside Bromon. I um, I spent a couple of hours last week in the engine room myself. But on, buddy. On, on. So this is where I spent a bit of time down in here. I had to come back to get my bloody tools. I went to work on my car and I couldn't <laughs> left my tools behind. Which is no good. You can't leave your tools behind. But anyway. So, Caterpillar engine. This is a 3304 PC. Um, unfortunately she's gone under, under water. Um, I started trying to um, strip it, just um, you know get things done, but I, I'm struggling. Um, I checked the oil just on that, um, checked the oil there, it seemed okay, but yeah. It's got a cap over where the dipstick goes, so. But um, yeah, she's up. I don't know what year it is. Um, so she needs to come out. Get the gearbox out as well. Um, but uh, yeah, my I'm 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 too buggered in the body to to be able to do it. I thought I'd be able to do it, but. I was mistaken. I was seriously mistaken. But apparently they're an amazing engine. A really good engine. Um, so hopefully I'll, I'll have another crack at... Um, have, have, hopefully I'll have another go at um, pulling this down and seeing if she's all okay. I found a rebuild kit in America for it too, which is pretty good. And... Um, Quite affordable, I thought, around about the 800 US dollar mark, which includes bloody pistons, bearing, uh, liners, ring set, so gaskets, the lot. So, yeah, you'll have to check it all out one day at a time. <laughs> 